Hey guys, what's going on? It's Don here from Nova Spirit Tech and welcome back to the channel. And today we are going to be taking a look at Portainer and app templates specifically for ARM devices such as Raspberry Pi. So let's get started. Now Portainer IO is a manager for dockers and specifically if you need to manage, maintain, delete, create, you could all do it through Portainer without using any command line. One of the biggest features you have with Portainer is something called app templates, which is similar to Docker Compose, where you can create those compose files and just deploy stuff on the fly. Portainer has something very similar and it runs off a JSON file. Now I've been working on my own Portainer app template specifically for ARM devices, which is ARM and ARM64, which usually should run on Raspberry Pi and many devices like that. Now I've actually copied the list from self-hosted, which is the website right here. And I basically cloned it over to my repository and I'm using it as a base. It does have about 50 to 60 Dockers, I believe in there. And believe me, Docker Hub has even more. And I want to add as much as I can to this app template. So what I started off with is just cleaning out the list. Anything that is only for x86 that you can't get ARM devices on, I removed from the list. And anything specifically just for ARM devices, I will install onto my own Raspberry Pi just to make sure it does install, similar to some of the stuff that I've been doing on my Pi hosted series. And when I do notice that it does support it and it doesn't have that particular thing working, I would actually try to find the reason why and fix that as well. I'm also running off a second list, which is called the awesome Docker list, I believe. I'll leave a link down in the description. And on this list, he has a huge GitHub list of exactly what programs and what categories that you could run off Docker. So I'm basically looking through this list and adding them onto my app template. And the reason for this video is because I need your help. Uh, this is a lot of work, which I could try to do, but it'll take a lot of time. So if you guys could help me either uh, find issues with it. If there's something wrong with it, please submit an issue. If you guys are familiar with portainers and creating app templates and you want to submit something, please do so. Submit it, I'll check it, and then we could just push it to the upstream. If you guys have any recommendations on programs that is not on my list or it's not there yet, we could also put requests in so you can, we could start adding more programs to this list. So basically, I, I need the community's help to help maintain, build, and also support this list. This way, we have this one go-to list that we could use for all ARM devices. Now, if you guys could share it on anything, Reddit or Facebook or anything, just to get the list out there so we could get more maintainers, more people, and more help just to build this list up, we could probably have a really successful app template list for Portainer. Anyway, I'm gonna keep this video short. That's the big announcement that I wanted to let you guys know. Um, I will be building on this list as much as I can, as much as my free time allows me to. I hope you guys can help get me some support. If you want, you could join my Discord. I do have now a new channel called Pi Hosted that will be doing some you know, chatting with that as well in there too. So I have a link down in the description for that. Now, if you guys are new to this channel and never seen my series, if you want to go check that out, it's right up here, uh, which is called the Pi Hosted series. And if you guys are new to this channel, consider subscribing. That's it for me. And as I say, my nerd cave, hack till it hurts.